In the episode number 91 of the ACP Tech News, we talk about the new Subrent DDR5 SO DIMM RAM modules, the new EVGA Supernova G7 power supply series, Micron launches a 1.5TB SD card, and SteelSeries has a new mini gaming keyboard. We start with Subrent, which has announced their new DDR5 SO DIMM RAM kits. These new RAM modules follow the same design as the rest of the Subrent series, RAM memory and SSDs alike with a black PCB and copper highlights on the labels. These new DDR5 SOD modules are running at a frequency of 4800 MHz and CL40. They are available in different capacities, 8GB, 16GB and 32GB. One feature of these RAM modules is the copper foil applied on the sides of the RAM stick. How good that will do in a closed off environment such as a notebook, we shall see. Next, EVG has a new Supernova power supply series, the Supernova G7. The new EVG Supernova G7 is available in different wattage capacities, 650 watts with a price tag of 159.99 US dollars, 750 watts with a price tag of 169.99 US dollars, 850 watts with a price tag of 189.99 US dollars, and 1000 watts with a price tag of 239.99 US dollars. In terms of the features, these power supplies are using a fully modular design, Japan-made capacitors and LED system load indicator bars, which will tell you exactly and in real time how much load your system is placing on the power supply. The EVG Supernova G7 and its variants are sold with a 10-year warranty. For cooling, these power supplies are equipped with an EVG 120mm fluid dynamic bearing fan. As for the OEM behind these new power supplies, it's anyone guess until we see some reviews. It can either be Superflower, FSP or Seasonic. I hope for the latter. We continue with Micron, which has launched a new series of high-capacity SD cards, the i400 series. And this one is special thanks to its vast storage capacity availability. The SD cards are available with storage capacities starting at 32GB and up to 1.5TB. The i400 series is Class A rated and the SD cards are said to last up to 5 years in a 24-7 writing environment. Unfortunately, these SD cards are not destined for the consumer market, however, we hope that this might change in the future as the requirements for high capacity SD cards is on the rise for both cameras and smartphones. And finally, SteelSeries has a new mini gaming keyboard, the Apex Pro Mini. The new keyboard uses the OmniPoint 2.0 switches which have magnetic sensors inside them and can be adjusted to fit your needs. The Apex Pro Mini is a small 4-factor keyboard with only the main keys present on the casing. No numpad and no dedicated arrows are used on these models. The casing of this keyboard is made from aluminum which is not new or unusual as aluminum keyboards are better built and will last longer under pressure. The keycaps are made from PBT plastic, which is better in terms of quality than ABS for example. These keycaps will last longer and maintain their texture as opposed to ABS keycaps, which will get a glossy shine after a long period of usage. Unfortunately, the pricing is not yet established or known. And this is the end of the episode number 91 of the ASAP Tech News, one of the few tech news series which aims to deliver you the news as fast as possible for your convenience.